kids! Did you just hear something? That kind of sounded like a frog, didn't it? Oh, look! A mama frog and her baby tadpoles! Tadpoles is the larva stage of frogs before they transform into fully grown adults. Did you know that frogs go through this process and that it's called metamorphosis? Hi, my name is Zoe Allison, a student at the University of Texas at Tyler. And today, we're going to be learning about this amazing transformation, which we call the life cycle of a frog. This podcast has been brought to you by Title 2D Funding, Enhancing Education Through Technology. Like most insects and amphibians, frogs go through a process called metamorphosis. <laughs> What's metamorphosis, you might ask? Well, metamorphosis is a great and rather sudden change in appearances and character within an organism. Frogs experience this in a few different stages. Eggs, tadpoles, tadpoles with legs, froglets, and finally, adult frogs. A female frog can lay up to 4,000 eggs. Whoa, that's a lot of eggs, am I right? Those eggs then float on top of the water in a jelly mass or cluster. This stage only lasts for about one to three weeks. The eggs then hatch into our second stage, tadpoles. Once hatched, tadpoles take about 14 weeks to transform into tiny frogs. Within those 14 weeks, Tadpoles swim around feeding on algae and other small plant life. As they continue to grow, they enter the third stage, tadpoles with legs, growing their back legs first and then their front ones next. Meanwhile, the tadpole is also developing lungs and we can start to see a change in its head and eyes as they become wider. Once the lungs are completely formed and the gills have disappeared, we have reached our fourth stage, froglets. This tiny frog with its tail is ready to leave the water and explore its new home on land now. Its stomach has made other large changes as well and is now adapted to a bug-based diet. Once the tiny frog's tail has completely disappeared, it is now ready to enter the final stage of life, an adult frog. Whoa! He's gotten a lot bigger since the first time we saw him and now he's jumping all over the place. He's really coming into his new body. Well. That's all I got for this episode. Thanks so much for stopping by, you guys. I really hope you come back and see me next week, where we continue to learn about the nature's wonderful mysteries. See ya!